hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to embed a diagram from Droyo in microsoft powerpoint let's begin now the first thing that you need to do is to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in microsoft powerpoint i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go embedding Diagrams in Droyo going to PowerPoint is a very easy. It's a simple process that is helpful for enhancing presentations and effectively communicating complex ideas. Now, once you are logged in to both your account in Droyo and PowerPoint, the first thing that you need to do is you want to make sure that to export the uh, diagram that they have created here in Droyo. All right, so one of the easiest method is going to the file section all right go to the export as we have a lot of options here you can export as png jpeg webp svg pdf vsdx html and a lot more if you go to the advanced section you have an option here again to check all these but for now what i'm going to do is maybe save like a like an image for now export as um, jpeg if you do that you would be asked to select the size is it going to be the diagram or the whole page we're just going to look for the diagram you can check check the uh, appearance if it's going to be light or dark i'm going to make it dark you can include shadow and grid if you click that click the uh, export button it would be forwarded to the section we're in you can choose from any of the following where you want to save this exported diagram here in Droyo. Is it going to be your Google Drive, OneDrive, or Dropbox, GitHub, GitLab, download? So what we're going to do is we're going to explore both accounts. We're going to uh, save it to OneDrive, but for now, we're going to click the uh, download button. Click OK. Now we're going to the Microsoft PowerPoint. Now, once you are logged into your Microsoft account, I want you to hover to the left side panel of the dashboard. I want you to click the PowerPoint. It would be forwarded here where you can start from any of the uh, template, but let's try to click the blank presentation. It would be forwarded here. It takes a little while, and then we can rename this. We're going to click the insert button. From here, we can insert a picture from this device, obviously. All right, so this is going to be the diagram that we have exported from Droyo. All right, so I'm going to max, max this out. Then I'm going to add another one. I'm going to put this in right here and then another image. So our deep lamps will go. So that's one way. Basically, um, importing the uh, diagram from Droyo using the insert options. All right. Pictures, device, and that's one thing. Now, the next option is we're going to add a new page here. All right. So. I'm going to right click on it, click and new slide, because the next thing is I want you to go over again to your Droyo diagram builder. Go here on the file section and click the embed section. All right. So you have multiple options here. Of course, we're going to choose the Microsoft Office. All right. And all I have to do. You see this option right here that says draw your diagrams. I want you to click the get it now button. All right. And of course, you just have to sign into your Microsoft app source. All right. And tell the email address of the account you want to use when acquiring apps on my um, app source. And from here, you just have to follow the on screen instructions. All right. You'd be able to integrate draw your diagrams directly to your PowerPoint. All right, wait for it to load. Takes a little while. Now, once you're happy with that, you see, 
it's very easy because all I have to do is to open it in PowerPoint. Now, let me tell you that it only works within the uh, Microsoft Office Online or Microsoft PowerPoint Online. So you can't do it on the uh, Droyo offline or the desktop application or the uh, Microsoft PowerPoint application, all right? If you're using the standalone uh, software, you're not going to be able to do it, all right? And from here, all I have to just click on the open in PowerPoint and you would be forwarded to the PowerPoint platform itself, all right? It takes a little while, but again, it reminds you that this add-in works only in Excel 2013 or later in Windows, Excel 2016 or later in Mac. Excel on the web, PowerPoint 2013 or later. Just wait for it, click on PowerPoint. Once you do that, you will see that you will be forwarded to your Microsoft PowerPoint directly and you would have all these options. Now, of course, you can control, copy this, and maybe ads. You can, you have now the uh, option to duplicate this depending on your purposes, all right? And from here, we can add more engaging information here, for example, on um, this, all right? Once you're happy with it, click the file section. You can save it. You can share it with people, which is one of the good things about uh, integrating Droyo to PowerPoint. If you are working with multiple people or multiple freelancers in a certain project or with their client, you might want to add their name here, the group, if they're part of a group, and of course, the email. You see, there is um, like a access level if you wanted. You can choose from they can edit and make any changes or they can only view and cannot make changes and of course just click the send button you also have the option to copy that link because if you wanted to send it to a non powerpoint user or non droyo user you might want to send them in an email or maybe to your social media channels such as whatsapp snapchat instagram and facebook or instagram on the file section again you have the option to print full page slides print slides with notes and of course the print handouts so you have all of these options for you that is the reason why we're going to be embedding the draw you in powerpoint all right now another option that you can do is go to the file again if you want to embed this presentation all right for example you have embedded the uh, draw you diagram and then embed this PowerPoint now to our presentation. You can also to do that by clicking the generate button. So you have all these um, seamless integration with both of these platform. All right, copy that and you'd be able to present it. All right, close it. The last thing that you need to do from here is to create a copy online or download a copy offline. So you'll have like a backup data of this Im uh, embedded draw your diagram here in Microsoft PowerPoint. And of course, you also have an option to download it as a physical file thank you so much for watching we will see you again in the next video